Hey, what's up guys? It's me, Mr. Game here and welcome back to my channel. I'm here today to unbox and have a first look of the product of Elgado. Although this product has already been launched for several years, finally I got my hands on it. Last week I have shared an Elgado capture card. Do check it out if you haven't already. That capture card can capture most of your device such as like your iPad or your camera. Alright guys, let's get back to the stream deck. This stream deck is an essentially like a mini keyboard or a number pad that has an individual badly LED screen button. And what that does is if you're streaming on whether like it on Twitch, Facebook, YouTube and you're using OBS, this button will help you to do things in stream like change scene and certain transition to bring out things like GIF or graphic and this thing it's just amazing. So in this video I'm just going to do a quick little setup and pretty soon I probably next week I will drop a full review after using it. I'm actually very pumped about this unboxing because they are not only for streaming but also there are other macros like game, video editing or photo editing like Premiere, Final Cut Pro, Photoshop etc. Best of all, they are not only limited to just Windows but also Mac OS too. So without further ado, let's jump into it. First thing out of the premium box, there is this quick start guide. It's definitely useful to take your time jumping into something like this. This guide explains most of the basic stuff you need to know, like how to set up and how it works, etc. This is the main unit itself. I don't know what kind of material they use, but everything seems quite premium to it and it comes with a uh, undetachable USB that is sealed to the unit itself but we will talk more on to that later on inside there's this little 10 kick stand kind of thing so you can pop it up onto your desk they do have some feet on the back side so you can see if you want to use it like a low angle or a high angle depending on your preference we just have another little product guide probably is some warranty information or stuff which you probably will not be interested in but they are there one thing i really really like is the form factor it's not big and it's nicely designed as some of you may know that i'm all about the design it it's compact and it's easy to move around as for the button it's not those tactile button you have on your keyboard but it's like some rubber dome jelly feel like okay right now they are blanks but they are individual lit up and this little led screen pretty much you can put graphic and things like that on all these keys there are 15 keys here which is pretty cool one of the things that i dislike is that it is non-detachable for the usb and it's probably like three feet long in length so just take good care when you're carrying it around here i'm using a mac to download the software and we will see how it works i like how quick and easy it is it's very intuitive and i love the drag and drop feature they have so i'm going to run through some stuff with you guys quick little example things like bringing out the website all you got to do is just to drag it over to the box just to drag it into the software and it will prompt it straight away i'm going to paste a youtube link on one of the box here and you can and change the logo and you can click on the little logo here to change to whatever graphic that you want so i'm going to just put a chrome logo and just like that it straight away shows on the stream deck you need and once everything's set just press the button and it just work amazingly so are you a subscriber already not yet just remember to hit the subscribe button 
Okay, back to the topic. So once you done and you click it, it will instantly do whatever action that you place it in the stream deck. Just like that, I have a Philips Hue light. I can toggle it on and off just by pressing a button. And you can create like folders, subfolders, and it's really really cool. Alright guys, that wraps up my quick little unboxing and the first look of this new Elgado stream deck that I have. I was really really surprised on how easy to use the software and the hardware itself. It's really simple, it's self-explanatory which is really great. It is user friendly. I don't think it's going to tear anybody away just because it seems like a very confusing tech stuff setup process and everything you know after watching this video you should know how to just set up your own stream deck if you guys are interested in this video i will link that down in the description below and i will I'll try to release my full review so comes with full detail the pros and cons and the rundown of the Alcadro stream deck i'm pumped about it and i hope that you guys are pumped too if you like this video make sure you slap a like button give me a big thumbs up show your support and follow me on instagram and i have a brand new gaming live stream facebook page or i will link that in the description below and i thank you for your time stay home stay safe and i will see you in my next video okay thanks bye, bye.